Hello Antique Lovers, this is Deanna from Vintage Touch and I have an item here that I recently found that I would like to share with you. It is a unique piece and it does have some many mechanical aspects to it so I, I think that sometimes whenever it's like that it's always helpful to see how it operates on video. This piece is a handheld fan and it is made of wood you can see the grain of the wood here and on the front. I'm not sure what kind of wood it is, possibly an oriental wood. It does have an Asian motif, so that would be my guess. This fan has a unique characteristic in the fact that it has a little oval mirror on the front there. I'm judging from the aging of the mirror there that it's probably from the period between 1920s to 1940s. It, I love the uh, aged appearance on old mirrors. I think it does give it that one-of-a-kind vintage charm. This piece on the back shows a little blue bird with a, like I said, an Asian type of motif with an olive branch or some other type of branch uh, that he's carrying there. It measures about 10 inches long, not counting the little tassel at the top. And then for the most unique feature that I think this has, and I'm going to try to pull this down so you can see the whole thing here, and hopefully it works for me. When you pull the little top knot up like that, it opens up into an accordion type, almost full circle there. And if I pull this down, maybe you can see the top knot at the top after it's open. This is kind of like a printed parchment type of paper that's in the accordion fashion. And the lace around the edges is real lace. It's not paper lace. That's the front and there's the back. There's a few little wrinkles right there but nothing severe and there doesn't seem to be any breaks or tears. And then if you want when you want to put this back this little tassel is attached to a little bit more sturdy um, slat there that the paper is attached to and you just push down like that and you keep pushing and it will close completely down. You can see on the sides the mechanism there with the string that allows you it to function the way that I just showed you. The bottom here has a little metal ring that's attached. I think this is a very unique little piece. Like I said, it is going to appear in my online store and the link to that will appear in the video. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comment section below. I hope you enjoyed this, and thank you so much for watching.